5. Yaoi The elusive hairy giant entity known in Australia as a Yaoi, Dooligil, hairy man, or Yahoo, is said to be attracted to electricity meters and may possibly be interdimensional. It has been reported that an electrical feeling phenomenon occurs when encountering a Yaoi. It is described as icy cold, sometimes inducing paralysis. According to local Aboriginal legends, the Dooligal lives in another realm. They often appear during storms, enticed by the electrical charge of lightning. 4. Arm Failure Mall Arm Failure Mall or the Big Grey Man or the Grey Man, is the entity or presence which haunts or roams Ben McDewey, the highest peak of the Cairngorms. Although sightings are rare, the Arm Failure Mall is described to be around 10 feet tall, wide shoulders, long wavy arms, and have olive-coloured skin which is covered in short brown fur. 3. Yeti Yeti, Migoi or abominable snowman, is a large, dark brown or white, ape-like animal inhabiting the Himalayan mountains. Indigenous people have described it as having an air cavity inside its skull, negating high altitude sickness, able to turn invisible, and turn their feet face backwards, making it difficult to track them. In 1961, the Nepal government officially declared the Yeti to be a real animal. Two. Sasquatch Sasquatch, also known as Bigfoot, is described as a hairy, gigantic, humanoid entity. A description given by a Native American, is that they are solid enough when they're here. They make tracks, kill animals. But they can disappear, totally. What our people are saying, really, is that these things are from another dimension. They may be things we are not meant to find out about. 1. Hibakon The Hibakon, or Hinagon, is described as being about 5 feet tall, covered in brown fur, with white hands, large white feet, and smell of rotting flesh. They are usually spotted in the forests of Mount Heba. Urban legends claim the creatures are mutated humans from the atomic blast at Hiroshima. Encounters with Hibokon are described as non-threatening, mesmerizing, calm, and having a feeling of connection with the entity. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more episodes.